Good afternoon from London Stansted and welcome to a new video. Today I'm going to travel in an airline which I've never flown before. I'll fly to Helsinki in Finland with Loader Motion. Loader Motion flights are basically Ryanair flights. They are sold on the Ryanair website and they also have a Ryanair flight number. However, the aircraft is going to be different, but I will mention that later. So first of all, let's head to the Ryanair check-in counter. There were literally no queues today, so checking them back only took a minute. The airport seemed to be a bit busy that day, so I was expecting a long queue at security. But surprisingly not even that, there were only a few other passengers. Check-in and security took me only about 10 minutes that day. I'm pretty sure Stansit is not always that efficient. Or is it? Let me know in the comments. After security you have to go through the street free shop and now we are airside and we have some time to kill until boarding starts. There are many different restaurants at Stansted Airport. We decided to go to Wetterspoons. But even if you don't like that, there would be more than enough other options there. Wetterspoon is a British franchise and there are pubs and restaurants all over the country. So we had some good lunch there and now let's go to our gate. There's also no passport control when you leave the UK. And here's our aircraft for today's flight. It's a 16-year-old Airbus AP20. This exact aircraft flew for Turkish Airlines between 2013 and 2019. <laughs> so welcome on board this Lauda Motion AP20. I didn't get a window seat, so it's the aisle seat for me that day. So let's have a closer look at the seat. Here's the tray table, and these seats had something Ryanair seats don't have. There's a small pocket in front of your seat, and there's also a physical safety card. And you can even recline the seat, but I don't really need that for a flight which is not even 3 hours long. The legroom however is a bit tight with around 22 centimeters. We were a bit delayed because they had to refuel the aircraft, but a bit later pushback has already started and we are ready to depart. The flight time for today is exactly 2 hours and 32 minutes. A few minutes after reaching the cruising altitude, the crew started the in-flight service. They sold cold drinks, warm drinks and snacks on this flight. Considering I was flying on a low-cost carrier, the prices weren't that overpriced. I used the time on board to edit my latest video. In case you've missed it, it's in the description and it's also in the top right corner now. Now let's have a quick laboratory check. It was pretty interesting that everything here was written in English and German. Lauda Motion used to have a base in Vienna. This base was closed in 2020, so I assume the aircraft is based in Stansted since then. In the meantime, the sun has already set and we are going to land at a snowy Helsinki airport. But before that, a quick summary. London Stansted was really efficient that day. The flight itself was pretty chill, but really nothing special. This summer I'm going to fly long haul again, so make sure to be subscribed to the channel, because I have some really cool flights planned for this year. But for now, please enjoy the landing at snowy Helsinki airport.
I don't remember when I've seen that much snow at an airport for the last time, but well, I would say we just got a typical Finnish experience. I was also not really prepared for that, I was wearing sneakers. But welcome to Helsinki Vanta Airport. We arrived pretty late, so everything was already closed. And this video is already coming to an end. So thank you very much for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did so, leave a like and subscribe to the channel. It's totally free and you can still change your mind later. I wish you a great week and see you in two weeks for the next video.